Alright guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to program your windows to go up using uh, the remote key fob uh, by pressing the lock, pressing and holding on the lock button and that will raise your windows. Uh, basically we have to activate that feature that's already exist in the car is just not active in the US E39s. Uh, as you can see right now, if I press and hold on the unlock button, it will roll down the windows, but it won't roll them up, as you can see. So we'll have to fix that. Okay, and then in order to do that, you have to have the uh, basically the diagnostic tools um, I bought mine from eBay uh, I will put a link in the description from where I bought it from um, uh, basically because the guy was really helpful um, in terms of you know getting the program to be installed um, he even used a uh, team viewer and access my computer and I had some problems with the connections and he fixed them all for me and now I have the program up and running um, you can basically do everything with these uh, programs but what we're gonna do today is we're gonna program the um, the remote to uh, have the windows roll up when you hold the lock position um, and in order to do that, uh, we have to start off by uh, opening EMPA and making sure that we have connection. Oh, sorry. Okay, so first we have to put the car in ignition. Okay. And then we'll go to EMPA. Mm -hmm. See that? Two black dots. That means we're good. We're going to end EMPA now. And now we have to open NCS Expert. All right. Um, I'm not an expert in NCS Expert, but I only know how to do this. So just follow what I'm doing and you'll be good. Uh, first off, go File, then Load Profile, then Export Mode, then hit OK. Now, you have to click this, then click this, F3, then choose your chassis, in this case it's E39, click OK. Now these are the modules for the car, um, I'm guessing it's all the same no matter what you choose, but um, somebody told me that this one here is for the pre-facelift E39s. Uh, my car is a facelift. Uh, it's a 2002. So I'm going to keep it at this one. I'm going to hit OK. Now, uh, as you can see, the uh, program read all my information. Now we have to click back and then go to uh, process ECU and then we're going to choose the and now we're going to choose the GM3 module which is the module that sits uh, underneath the glove box uh, this module controls all the locks and all the windows and your uh, seats, uh, your memory seats, uh, all of that it's controlled by this module. So we're going to hit OK. And now what we're going to do is get, we're going to read uh, the module. So click Read ECU. And yeah, this should pop up. Don't worry about it, just close it. Now what happened is, is the program saved us a file um, and that file contains the reading uh, 
for the module and what's active and what's not. Uh, but it's in the German language. Uh, but I figured which file, uh, which thing I have to change in order to activate the roll-up window. So all we have to do, as you can see here, I have a Mac, uh, but still I have Windows in here. So we'll go to computer and see. Uh, then NCS expert then we'll go to work then you'll find this file here which is fswpsw.trc gonna right click on it then open with then okay and uh, this is what I was talking about, the active. Okay, now we're looking for this word. Um, it's in German. Um, but I, I'll, put a, a, um, I'll put the word in the description box. So I'm going to hit Command F and Windows. I think it's Control F. Um, sorry. Command F. And then this should pop up search and then I'm gonna pa paste this uh, uh, word I'm gonna look for it oops oh it's right here okay as you can see here um, it's active I actually already changed it so uh, this was saying just like this let's pretend this is what it is it's saying niche active all you have to do is just select the niche and then delete it so let's do that now let's pretend that this is what it is um, this is the word you're gonna find it like this okay you're gonna find it exactly like this all you have to do is just go here and select this and delete it okay now pay close attention to this uh, after you deleted the thing here uh, all you have to do is go a uh, file then save us then um, select all files and then we're gonna change the extension of this file to man so it's already existed so just click on it and hit save and then hit yes okay then close this close this close NCS expert now open it again and do the exact same thing hit load profile expert mode and then this and this then e39 same thing wait for it then back then now uh, we have to hit process ECU GM3 same thing then change job, then we'll have to select SG Coderin and hit OK and then hit execute job. Okay, after that, it should tell you here that it's already coded. I already did that, so I'm not going to do it again. But that's all you have to do just hit execute job and wait like a couple seconds. It will say done, then close it. Then we're good. Close everything up, close the computer, disconnect your cable, alright, then turn the ignition off, now we're going to try it.
See, it works.